How do you handle giving references when the only relevant one is your manager from your current job? Yeah, so references are um, a, are a thing of, of uh, are a boomer thing, right? Like re references are, are, are a relic, are a boomer relic, uh, or are a relic of a bygone era. I shouldn't say boomer relic of a bygone era. They're a boomer relic they're, they're of the era of the boomers, right? Like references are for when, you know, you, you could walk, walk in someplace and give a firm ha handshake and hand over your, your, uh, your, um, your references and they, they, they'd hire you, right? It's like, what's the point of, of and, and this shows you, right? Like what I, was what I was talking about, the employers being inefficient, um, they don't know what they're doing. Like they, they just go with the flow. It's like, what's the point of paying for background checks and even employment checks? And you're also gonna get references, right? Anytime I've been asked for references, I just ask a friend like, hey, uh, this employer needs me uh, to provide references. Can you be a reference a reference for me? And yeah, they, they always say, yeah. Uh, I mean, I've been I, I've even been, been witness of like the, the employer, the prospective employer emails my friend and my email and my friend sends me the email and they this is what they're asking. What do you want me to tell? And like I write my own reference and like, hey, tell them this. And they send them. Um, I actually got a pre prestigious job at, at, a, at, a, at a pre, I mean, not, not the, the job is not prestigious. I got a job at a very prestigious company recently. And that's exactly what happened. They asked for references, three references, two managers, one coworker. Uh, I asked three friends. Um, one of them was actually an ex manager. We, we remained friends. Um, but, you know, like completely relevant. I, ju I just asked them like, hey, you know, fill this out for me. They all send me the email with the reference note, with, with what the employer was asking. Uh, I have used a burner phone and used a fake voice to give myself a job reference. <laughs> well, that works as well, right? Like I've never had the, you know, I've, I've never had to do that. That's pretty funny. Uh, you know, that, that can work. But, but that just shows you, right? Like burner phone, fake voice. This is this is pointless. The references are pointless. Don't worry about them. Have your friend give you be your reference. Get a voice changer. Be your own reference. Uh, buy a domain <laughs> and give a give a domain. Uh, you know, job stacking whatever uh, mydomain.com, mybusiness.com uh, email and be your own reference, right? It's uh, like, it really, like this thing is gonna go away as soon as as, as, as boomers, you know, die. I don't, I don't, I don't hate boomers, you know, I, I've mentioned them a lot, but it's really because we've nerd a lot of their system, a lot of their practices, right? But that thing is just gonna, like, what's the point, again, what's the point of doing background checks and, and, and reference check, I'm sorry, background checks and employment checks, and then you're also, and th the references are provided by you, you know, like it, it would make sense, right? Like if, if they were like, um, calling your employer themselves to get the, you know, uh, did Rolf work here, right? Like, like, who was his manager? Okay, I got the, like, if they got the references themselves, they don't, like, you provide them. Like, that's why I said, like, get your dad to be your reference, get your cousin, get your friends, get your girlfriend to be your reference. Like, it doesn't really matter.